And Tuesday, we found out that the U.S. job openings unexpectedly increased in May as state economies reopened and businesses looked to hire new employees. Fed's Bostic saw signs that economic activity is leveling off. Top British and EU negotiators announced they'll dine together, kicking off the latest round of Brexit talks, with the top EU official saying he wants an agreement, but not at any price. Last but not least, RBA kept interest rates unchanged as expected. Welcome to the Tikmal Update. I'm Kenna Daniel, the founder of the Investiva movement. Make sure to subscribe to the Tikmal YouTube channel and support us by liking and sharing this video with your forex trading friends. On Wednesday, we'll be looking at the UK's supplementary budget as well as China's inflation rate. Today, I'm looking at the pound dollar pair, which continues to range between 1.27 and 1.22. It was unable to break below the daily Ichimoku cloud last week and now appears to be heading back up towards the upper band of the range. With the future cloud thinning, we could expect the pair to top out once it hits the resistance level and then head back, head back down towards the lower band of the range. Are you camp bull or camp bear for, for a pound dollar? Head over to the comment section and let me know. Of course, trading in the financial markets involves a risk of loss and you should only trade the money that you can afford to lose. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up and subscribe to the Tickmill YouTube channel. I'll get back to you with more updates tomorrow.